score, but and avoid that. And they do. Kong with the attack. Wow, that was a beauty. Kandasami fainted high and went for the... I don't know when that 60 seconds is up, but it's got to be getting soon. But it's moot. As Kandasami scores. Kong went for the attack. Wow! Uh, nice attack by Kong, uh, having one great year. And uh, Kong, no slouch at all, double touch, uh, took third at the Grand Prix in Doha. So three podiums in the Grand Prix double. And the second intention trying to draw to Kadasami's attack so far. Well, that time she went straight, went to a different target. Instead of going high, she went for the leg. Watch this. She fainted high and went for the thigh. Okay. So there's a little attack. Let's watch this attack. To the shoulder. Yeah, pretty much. So she followed it up with something after fainting to the toe. We've seen that a couple times. And while she was planning, Kandasami, what she was going to do and where she was going to faint, a straight attack to that same target, sort of the inside. Okay, Kandasami has to push. Wow, and while she's pushing, I think it's the same target, the shoulder target. Let's see. I think if I'm Kandasami, I let time run out and regroup for the next period and not let the score get further away from her, but unfortunately she did. Look, the attack is short. Wow, Kong is able to angle her body back, causing this attack to full. Okay, Kandasami finally, for the first time, she went since the first period. She fainted a few times, let's faint. And she went for the knee, not the toe, okay. So that's a good start. That's a good double for Kong. I mean, she really shouldn't do that anymore. Oh boy. And while she was setting it up, Kong said. Twelve to six. And that's an easy double for Kong. She's two touches away from the goal. Watch Kandasmi attack. Just a double. Kandasmi has to take the blade if she can. Oh, Kong attacked from way at a distance and somehow was able to put the light on. And she's one away from the goal, way at a distance, and scored on the second remise. Almost turning herself upside. Uh, Why you go? And Kong is your champion. No doubt about it. She was the best fencer here. She earned it. Number two ranked in the world. And she was clearly the best fencer here. A fitting champion. And your winner. Kong Man Y Vivian of Hong Kong wins in capital result. Let's watch. Again to the high line. And there's your winner. Let's see the smile. There it is. She pretty much dominated this bout after an early, it was sort of 50-50. Once she got the lead, uh, she dominated.